So we have a delicious roasted spaghetti squash with a creamy, bowery uh, baby kale. And this is one of my favorite recipes to kind of work with. Uh, this roasted squash right here, uh, simple roast, um, cut it in half, scooped out all the seeds, um, and roast it about 400 degrees Fahrenheit, just until it's nice and tender, right? But you're just gonna take a fork and just fluff it, and you can see how just naturally all those Beautiful fibers. It turns just into out. spaghetti. It literally yeah. turns into spaghetti. Isn't that cool? Right? So we'll do it on that, the other side. That, it's just, and it's in its own dish. Because <laughs> it's named spaghetti squash, that makes kids like it more than they would like just plain old squash. You know what? You'd be surprised. Like my daughter, this is like her, like the favorite part when we uh, have spaghetti squash at home. She just likes to take the fork and just like fork through it. And really, it's, it's fun. You can get the kids involved. It's like magic. It's like the perfect. Right. It's yeah, like it really magic. is. It really is magic. Absolutely. Um, so next up, we take you know more of my favorite ingredients. We got some avocado oil. We're just going to grab a couple of tablespoons. Gotcha. And then we have some garlic right here, and we're just going to just sauté that up, just so this, or sweat that up, just a little bit, about a minute or so. Kind of get all those natural kind of aromas and fragrances all out the way, right? Sprinkle just a touch of salt, just to help extract a little bit more of that uh, flavor. And just to get a little, right, of the juice out, right? Absolutely, yeah. And then we'll take some of this beautiful, delicious Bowery baby kale. And we'll just go ahead and add that in there. So we'll go ahead and sweat that out. So we added a little bit of cream cheese. We're adding a little bit of uh, Parmesan Reggiano in there right now. A small touch of salt just to kind of pump up a little bit of that umami. And then we just have a beautiful, creamy, cheesy kale base it's 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 two seconds it melts beautifully it, it's it's neutral but it has a very distinct flavor as well so you can add it up with so many other things like this kale that we're doing right here so we have our delicious mix we'll go ahead and take some breadcrumbs right here again one of my favorite parts just go ahead and add a little bit of that beautiful dressing right here you can go ahead and add some more cheese in there if you'd like as well and then we're going to just broil this a couple of minutes Right in the oven. Pop it in, pop it out. Pop it in, pop it out. You know it too well. <laughs> and then what we have here after it's broiled is this absolutely delicious. I mean, it's cheesy, it's fun, it's quick. Um, you're, you're eating healthy, you're, 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 you feel confident, it's brilliant, yeah.